Okay, now on to the next track in Campbell's Melodic Kingdom series, man. Uh, this one over here is Linkin Park, once again, because this is a Linkin Park series, basically. Uh, the Little Things That Give You Away. I don't think I've ever heard this track before. And now we're sticking with within the Minutes to Midnight um, album as well. For those of you who actually want to know sort of like the progression of this series, you have to go back to the very first uh, video very first video i dropped of this series so that you can actually see the order in which we are doing these tracks because the order is somewhat important right um so yeah so uh that's it this is uh, not much uh to say over here just this is part of the minutes to midnight um um album as well this is the second track that we've we're doing of this album so for those of you also who want to know more about this uh, custom series this product that we're offering um, it's down in the pinned comment. We're leaving a link. We're leaving me. I'm leaving a link in the pinned comment um, for you to click, and you can go take a look at the. You can go take a look at the at what we offer. Wow, we, why am I always saying we for some odd reason? I think I think I, I speak of we as in like the cucumber squad. You know what I mean? And I, I, I think about it also from a business perspective because every time I'm speaking to to somebody when I'm doing like a a, a, a deal or whatever else, I always sell myself that way. Oh, we, 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 as if I'm talking about a business. You know what I mean? So yeah. Anyway, let's uh, go. The little things that give you away. Let's go. So coming through the windows, going up the stairs, um, you reach for me, and it's like the little things that give you away in terms of like not wanting to save me or can't help me. Is I don't know if he's talking about his psyche or if he's talking about an actual disaster of sorts. You know what I mean? Like some sort of natural disaster of sorts. Because it sounds like it's a natural disaster. What would be creeping through the windows, going up the stairs, where you're stuck and someone needs to reach for you to try and save you? Right? Is it about possibly being um, survivors that kind of got forgotten or didn't get helped because they weren't important enough? I don't know. I don't know. Through the windows, up the stairs, chilling rain, like an ocean everywhere. Or he also could be talking about a relationship of sorts, essentially, where he's drowning, he's going through a hard time, um, he's going through pain and agony, 
right? And he feels like he's drowning and he feels like he needs to be saved, but this person doesn't really care. So that's what's giving them away. It's like, you don't, it gives it away because you don't really care about me. It's all this facade, right? And all you've ever wanted was someone to look up to you, but, um, and, and, and here, here I am. I do, I do look up to you, right? So please save me. Could be that, that from that perspective as well. It could be a relationship thing. generations disappear now i'm going back to my initial um hypothesis of a natural disaster Washed away as a nation simply stares don't want to reach for me do you i mean nothing to you again playing into okay i'm going with the whole i'm going with the whole um natural disaster vibe and i'll tell you why i'm going with the natural disaster vibe is because i kind of feel like this album does have a bit of a political spin to it right uh it does have um political notions in it right so i think this is now a track about some sort of natural disaster where um the government is supposed to uh, um fix it um, you as a leader, all you've ever wanted is for someone to look up to you, right? Because that's why you became a leader. So now here's a chance to fucking lead, right? And I look up to you. Hey, yo, help me, <laughs> right? It's like, I look up to you. Uh, you're getting what you wanted, but can you do your job? So I'm going with maybe the political side of it. Although, although, no, 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 I'm sticking, I'm sticking, I'm sticking, I'm sticking, I'm sticking, I'm sticking with my political part. I'm sticking with the fact that some natural disaster that didn't get handled properly, and that is, he's singing about that, okay? That, that's what I'm sticking with. I'm going up and down over here, I'm, I don't know where exactly, I'm very unpacked here. All you've ever wanted was someone to truly love. I've never heard this track before. I'm really loving the instrumentation in this, just by the way. I really, really am. instrumentation is actually it's, it's giving me that rescue mission feel doesn't it i don't know I, I don't know if that's making any sense it might be completely and utterly incoherent of me but it's giving me that it's hopeful 
It's hopeful, yet somewhat pleading and very down the rescue mission, I feel. I don't know why, why I feel that way, but anyway. That, that notion of like little things give you away which again could tie into that relationship uh, theory as well but i'm going to stick with the political theory over here because it could also tie into the political side where it's like it's these little things you know it's all these these uh, uh um uh, you know these sayings and all these speeches about unity and people and um how we are one uh, you know all that bullshit try to act patriotic and try to act like you actually give a damn about the people right but it's little things little things that like that the government could easily easily resolve and they have the resources to re to resolve and they have the resources to resolve quickly and effectively right but they drag their feet right the real, the people who, like the first responders and those kind of people, right, those people work hard and do what they need to do. But for like governments to pass anything, to have some sort of relief for people who go through those kind of tragedies, they'll drag their feet. And it's like, those are the things, those are the little things that give you away, that you don't really give a fuck about us. You know what I mean? Not that, not that uh, um, um, we didn't know this. <laughs> we didn't know this. If you still think that uh, <laughs> the government cares about you, then, uh, yeah, I don't know. I can't help you. <laughs> Yeah, so that was a cool track. Never heard this track before. Um, yeah, so it's one of those two uh, theories for me. It's either a relationship where you're drowning and um, that person's actually, they don't care about you. They don't care to see you in any, in, in any sort of agony. They don't give a shit. They're not, while you're drowning in all of your misery, they're not willing to extend a hand to help you out. And that was their true colors. Um, or on the other side, it is something to do with some natural type of disaster where um, the governments don't really give a shit about you and they drag their feet because who are you? You're just a number, right? Um, the bureaucracy comes first. I don't know. You guys let me know, right? So, um, yeah, fire. So far, so far, everything has been pretty amazing. But uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.